Skoda won't reveal the next generation Superb until November. It has already teased the wagon, and new spy photos show off the liftback sedan still in development. The images captured the vehicle testing on the Nürburgring racetrack with a full-body camouflage wrap hiding the model's evolutionary design changes. The revamped styling is hard to spot on the Superb, but new elements exist here. The grille appears more upright, but that could be a trick of the camouflage. It sits above a tweaked front bumper, with vertical slats at the edges. The character lying down the side of the car is lower, bisecting the door handles, and the automaker moved the side-view mirrors from the A-pillars to the doors. The updated model should receive new headlight and taillight designs. The camouflage at the rear hides a lot of the vehicle. It'll likely debut with a revamped rear bumper and other minor alterations. This example tucks the car's dual exhaust system behind the rear valance. Skoda teased the superb combi last week and released many details about the model, including its dimensions and powertrain specs. Even though the wheelbases are unchanged, the sedan and wagon will be longer and narrower than the models they replace with increased cargo capacities. The entry-level Superb will feature a mild hybrid 1.5-liter engine powering the front wheels and making 148 horsepower. There will also be a 2.0-liter gasoline engine available. Its front-wheel drive configuration makes 201 horsepower, with the all-wheel drive version making 261 horsepower. Skoda will offer the Superb with a diesel engine. One tune makes 148 horsepower with the FWD setup, while the more potent version makes 190 with AWD. The Superb IV plug-in hybrid continues for the next generation model. The 1.5-liter engine pairs with a larger 25.7 kWh battery, churning out 201 horsepower. It'll have over 62 miles of all-electric range. We haven't seen the new cabin clearly, but we know changes are coming to the interior. Skoda will reposition the gear selector to the steering column. While the car will have an infotainment system measuring up to 12.9 inches, the Superb will retain manual controls for some vehicle functions, Skoda will reveal the Superb in November. It'll be produced alongside the 2024 Volkswagen Passat in Bratislava, Slovakia, relocating it from Kvasiny, Czech Republic.